Hello, welcome or welcome back. Today I am doing a collab with one of my dear sweet friends, Anya Stamper. I was about to tell you I have done multiple, multiple collabs with her, but she was my second collab that I've ever done with anybody. So she's really special to me. I absolutely love her. Please go check her out if you are from my channel and have not met her or haven't been over there. Anya Stamper, also known as Pink Sweets. The I is replaced with a one. I really want to know where she got her name <laughs> and how that all started. So I'm going to go ahead and prime my eyes with my MAC Paint Pot in Painterly. So I am going to go ahead and start there. Now we are using our Melt Vita palette, which I have a dupe for or I duped it out with my own collection. I will link the video up above just in case you haven't gotten a chance to go ahead and watch that. I love duping palettes. It's what I've been doing for the past couple months now and I have just been really into it and you guys seem to be enjoying, enjoying it as much as I have been. So that makes me super excited to know that we're kind of on the same page. Guys, I am so close to 500 subscribers. If you are new here, please go ahead and subscribe. I would love to hit 500 by my first year, which is January 29th, which is also my mother's birthday. I'm so excited. I'm going to be posting a one year on YouTube video and what I've learned, what kind of what I expected YouTube to be and what actually YouTube is kind of thing. You know what I'm saying? I feel like that would be important to people that want to start channels but haven't yet or kind of just to see if you feel the same way I do after you started your channel. I am, like I said, only a year into this, but I feel like it's important to share information and help one another. So... I am going to go ahead and dip into this shade right here. This is my Muerte palette. And this is my Vita palette. This shade is from ColourPop Dream Street palette and it's called Shooting Star. So I'm going to take it on this brush right here. I have my shirt that says Jog Mom on it. I got this from my great friend Chip O'Gray, which I will link her down below. Now I wanted to put this on for my collab with Anya as well because we're both dog moms and I love her dogs so much. They are, especially Sophie, okay, so Sophie is like my spirit animal, okay, so <laughs> she will be crying from the other room like, Mom, please help me get up on the bed, please. So she'll just be crying to Anya like, please, please help me out. And I'm like, oh, that's me. <laughs> please help me. <laughs> oh, especially lately, my husband and I have been going to the dog park to not only get our dogs exercise, but ourselves exercise because there's about a quarter of a mile little pathway and we will walk that a couple times and just you know get exercise and it's been really good but of course the first day I was like oh I'm really I'm really motivated <laughs> so I'm gonna walk a lot and I walked two miles and the first that was the first day and then the second day we only did three laps because <laughs> it was hurting from the first day and then the third day we met up with one of my dear sweet friends, Helen, who I absolutely adore. We walked six laps with her and then today we went again and walked three. So it's been kind of every other day and tomorrow I'm going to need to take a break because if you don't know, I am a military veteran and I got out for my hurt spine. So I have something called degenerative disc disease which isn't very uncommon like I thought it was but basically my discs in my lower back are getting pinched enough to where it's sending pain out to my hips so I'm feeling pain <laughs> even though I'm only working out but 
and, and I'm only walking too, so I'm going to dip into this shade. This is from Coastal Scents. It is called Timeless Taupe. I'm just going to put it on my outer corner right here. I don't know where I'm going with this look. I'm just winging it <laughs> like normal. But I wanted to tell you guys how just beautiful and amazing Anya is. Like I said, she was my second collab that we ever had, or that I ever had, not her. She collabs with everybody, and everybody I find through her, I'm like, oh, I, I love them. I have found Nona from <sighs> hashtag my so-called life. I know she's not a hashtag anymore, but she's in my so-called life 1977. I'll link her down below. I have found Debbie Knobloch, who I absolutely love. I think Debbie found me through Anya, but anyway, I love just the people she collabs with are just amazing, and yeah, that makes me amazing, yay! <laughs> this is the NYX Vivid Brights in the shade Get Money. Now. Like I said, if you have not met Anya yet, she does lots and lots and lots of beautiful makeup looks. I absolutely love them. Her just technique is different from mine because she's more of a pat set down more than me. I'm more of a big blender kind of person. But no, she's very sure of herself and she's just like boop, 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 I'm done. Obviously not like that and not as quick, but I just, I love her technique. So I have taken a few steps away from that, a few steps away, few tips from that, especially when I do my lid shades, but she does it all over and I love that. So I'm only putting that on the inner portion of my lid to get, hello. <laughs> To, I'm going to put some green down when I'm done. Okay, there we go. So, just, ooh, there's more green on here than there is on here. Which, this is dried out. So I need to get my spray that I normally use, but of course, I'm too lazy to go get up and go get it. <laughs> Okay, just like that. And now I am going to use this <clears throat> Classy Kate Cosmetics shade in Gamora. It's this beautiful, just limey green beautifulness. I'm just going to put that on top of that. Not that these shadows need base, a base, but I want to put it there to make that green really shine through. You know what I'm saying? And to have it stick and stay forever. Okay, just like that. So I'm going to put those down. Hmm, I think I'm going to go ahead and add this green right here, which this is called Python Green. And I'm going to put this in my crease as well, right there just where the green is in the front half, not on the back half of my crease. Just like that. Okay, so I'm going to be putting on my base makeup, all that other good shenanigan, and I'll be right back. Okay, I am back. I'm here to do my lower lash line. I'm gonna go ahead and take that Python green once again, just on a brush. And I'm going to put it all along my lower lash line, right there. Not, not enough. Cool. All right, just keep going with that shade on both sides. Okay, just like that. And then I am also going to take just a brush like this and I'm going to dip into that taupe shade 
and go along with my outer third. Oh, I did add a wing liner. This is the Chella liner that we got, I think, in a boxy charm or Ipsy. I don't remember. Sorry. <laughs> but it is a purple liner. I love greens and purples together. I think they're so beautiful and wonderful. But this is my final look. I want to thank Anya so incredibly much. She has been just so patient with me because I was in the middle of moving and then I got really sick with the flu and I had to just push back this collab and I felt so bad but she was just completely understanding and wonderful and I always 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 loved collabing with her and she's just amazing there's not many people that would want to push dates back you know a lot of people are like no I have my set dates I'm not switching it but she was so willing to be like okay I understand I got you and I was like she's really MVP <laughs> All right, but this is it for me. Let me know what you think down below. I would love to hear your thoughts. Again, if you have not checked out Anya, I would highly recommend you doing so. She's just amazing and wonderful. And I love her video, if I haven't mentioned this. Her video editing, like she barely edits out anything. Actually, I don't think she edits out anything. She just does her eyeshadow look and then her base makeup and calls it a day. Oh my gosh, yeah. She doesn't edit out anything, but uh, that's that's a true feat, you know, when you can't edit out anything. <sighs> Except me, who goes on ramble sprees. And <laughs> anyway, I'll let you get to it. I hope you all have a wonderful and fantastic day. I will see you all in my next video. Bye. Crap, I forgot to do an inner corner highlight. I'm going to use this it's from Tarte. It was one of their face palettes. I'm just going to press it right here. And now I'm done. Right? No. I need more. I need more. This is what I get for rambling. Oh, and there goes my dog. <laughs> Bye, guys.